Van Richten's Guide to the Ancient Dead was released in 1994, written by Skip Williams with interior art by Stephen Fabian and Paul Jacques, I hope I pronounced that right, with a cover by Jeff Easley. It is the sixth guide in the series and continues the format of being written in character and the DM information at the end of each chapter. The Ancient Dead is just another term for mummy. The Guide to the Ancient Dead does two things. It tries to establish that mummies don't have to have or be Egyptian priests wrapped in bandages. Any type of culture that entombs their dead with funeral rites and preserves them and has a process for them can be a mummy. The other is that mummies are kind of the priest version of lynches. Where there has to be a process for a being to become a mummy, somewhat like there has to be a process for a wizard to become a lynch. Mummies are categorized into power ranks, similar to vampire's age or ghost magnitude. This determines how powerful a mummy is, with the first rank being the lowest and the highest being the fifth. The book then goes on to describe the tickle, typical powers of mummies and, of course, their special powers. And then their weaknesses and strengths are covered as well. Mummies are usually dormant, and it takes some kind of specific act to awaken them, and the guy goes over the possible triggers. Then the guy goes over the different kinds of tombs mummies inhabit and the perils of adventures for disturbing them. And of course, the usual, typical mummy curses. The final chapter is on how to hunt and destroy these ancient creatures, reminding players that mummies can cast spells, change their forms into animals, or even look alive. Then of course the magical diseases such as mummy rot, which can be extremely deadly and is harder to cure in Ravenloft. I recommend Van Richten's Guide to the Ancient Dead. Like all the guides, it is great for players and DMs alike. Players will enjoy the Van Richten stories and learn a great deal from him. For DMs, this really expands the perception of what a typical mummy should be and gives them the tools to create really unique mummies for their campaign. In the caverns, crypts, and chasms of Ravenloft lie mummies and other horrors for whom sleep is a natural state. These are the ancient dead. Dreams of love, glory, and wealth subdue them through the ages, and time grows meaningless, until the greedy or foolish disturb their rest. When the ancient dead rise and walk again, evil spreads before them and destruction lies in their wake. In the land of mist, the ancient dead are unique monstrosities of astonishing power capable of rising again and again despite the efforts of the mightiest heroes. Only Rudolph Van Richten, Ravenloft's greatest foe of darkness, has occurred the knowledge necessary to stop them. Within this treatise, the doctor classifies these complex creatures, defines their common characteristics, and speculates upon their salient abilities. It may be impossible to destroy the ancient dead, but with persistence, good fortune, and Van Richten's wise counsel, one might send them back to their dreams.